Hello, welcome back to the channel. I have two major announcements to make today. And I will say that this is being filmed around April 1st, but this is not an April Fool's joke. These are two really big changes to this channel. First off, I am becoming a full-time YouTuber. I got burned out at my day job and for the most part, I've been part-time YouTubing all these years and I want to start doing it full-time. So you're going to see a lot more of me and I'm gonna see a lot more of you, hopefully. Um, you should see an increase in the output of my videos. Eventually, once I get things rolling, I still haven't finished my last day of my day job yet. I will also have more time to make the videos I produce better and I'll be more relaxed and uh, I should be able to uh, get in a good groove here. If you want to help me on this transition, the best thing you can do is to go over to Patreon and become a Patreon member of mine. For only one dollar a month you'll get exclusive behind the scenes videos of the making of some of these videos and you will also get early access to many of these videos. That leads me to announcement two and announcement one needed to happen for announcement two to happen. Now this is gonna take uh, a little bit of explaining to do before I actually tell what it is. When I first started doing this channel, I was doing mostly retro things. I was doing room tours of all these uh, machines behind me and I was doing reviews of old games and stuff like that, just really nerdy stuff. And that produced an audience for me, and those were the very early members of this channel, and a lot of them have been around a long time. Recently, I've also started doing some more modern game type stuff on this channel. I've done controller reviews, controller videos, and a lot of controller stuff. Those videos became really popular on this channel compared to everything else. Along with that came a new audience. These people um, were quite different than the other audience. So what I have today is this dual audience, uh, two major groups, uh, one that's more into retro stuff and one group that follows me because I helped them repair their controller or something like that. So let me show you what happens as a result of having that dual audience. I'm so glad this controller works thanks to Gaming the Systems tutorial. Oh, he posted a new video. About the Sega Genesis? Eh, I'm not interested in that. Cool, this retro game is so fun. Oh, Gaming the Systems posted a new video. How to repair your PS5 controller? No, thank you. I'll catch his next video. What you saw there was people swiping the video away. That may not sound like a big deal, but YouTube actually counts that and it counts it against the video. So if enough people do that, the video doesn't quite get presented to as many people as it would if there was more people clicking into it when it's first presented to them. So what happens is a lot of my videos go out to this dual group, but only a portion of them are interested in watching it. So the videos can get off to a slow start. So in order to solve this issue, I am creating a second channel and it's gonna be called Gaming the Systems Retro. In fact, it is already there, and I have already added two videos to it that are pretty big videos. One is the ultimate guide to the GameWave game system. And if you haven't heard about that, that's gonna be a great video for you to watch because it's about 25 minutes long and it's almost like a documentary. And included is a mini review of every game that was released for that system. I've also posted a video there that is a Q&A session you guys asked me some questions a while back and I'm answering them in that video and that ended up being a half hour. And it's packed full of interesting questions and interesting answers. So please check that out if that interests you. And a lot of it is about retro game collecting, by the way. I will post links to those videos in the description and I'm gonna put them at the end of this video as a clickable end screen so you can hop over to them. So what happens to the current channel that you're on? It's going to be renamed Gaming the Systems Modern. So you're gonna have a modern and a retro. I'm no longer going to be posting retro themed content on this channel. 
If that's gonna bother you, you might wanna start unfollowing this channel. It's actually gonna help this channel if you do. Because the things you're gonna be seeing here are a lot of tutorials and um, possibly modern game reviews of games that just came out and so forth. I, I have an interest in doing that. But most of it's gonna be tutorials on how to do things on modern systems. There was not really gonna be any way for me to appeal to both audiences I would have to do weird videos like, will my Sega Genesis controller work on the PS5? That would be a very narrow channel if I had to do videos like that. So hopefully you guys understand why I'm doing this split. I'm going to divide my effort evenly between these two channels. And since I'm full time now, I can do that. So it's not like you're going to notice a big drop off in one channel or another. With all that being said, I have another announcement, a bonus announcement, and this one's kind of small. Rodney is a character on this channel, and he doesn't really belong on this channel or the retro channel, really. He needs to be put on his own channel, so I created a third channel, and it's called Rodney's Underground Life. Now, I'm not going to do much with that channel. I do have a plan for an episode eventually on there, but for now, I'm, I'm going to put my concentration into gaming the systems retro and gaming the systems modern. I may repost and re-edit the Rodney videos I've already posted and put, put them there. Um, I will also put a link to that channel down below. If that interests you, go ahead and subscribe to it. Only if you think you're going to watch videos about this young kid doing things in the basement and in the crawl space. So, if you're a diehard member of me and you watch all my videos, I say subscribe to all of those channels. But if you're not going to watch those tutorials, then you might want to unsubscribe to this channel and instead just go to the retro channel. And uh, I look forward to beginning our new life there with you. I want to close this out with a thank you. Thank you for following me. Whichever path you take from this point forward on whatever channel, I want to thank you. This is a new phase in this channel and I hope it works out for you and I hope it works out for me and I'll see you out there.